Good evening, Kia ora, and welcome to Compline for Sunday, September 19th, 2021, from St. Margaret's Episcopal Church in Palm Desert, California. We will be using the Night Prayer Liturgy from the New Zealand Prayer Book for tonight's Compline. We've included a link to that service booklet in both the Facebook and YouTube channel posts. I would suggest if you wish to follow along and participate, you might want to pause the video at this point, open that file and have it available to you. If you have a New Zealand prayer book, night prayer begins on page 167, and you can always access the New Zealand prayer book at Anglican prayer book, all one word, anglicanprayerbook.nz. Anglicanprayerbook.nz. Your presence is indeed a blessing, and I invite you to join where the worship is indicated in bold. The angels of God guard us through the night and quieten the powers of darkness. The Spirit of God be our guide to lead us to peace and glory. It is but lost labor that we haste to rise up early and so late take rest and eat the bread of anxiety. For the beloved of God are given gifts even while they sleep. My brothers and sisters, our help is in the name of the eternal God who is making the heavens and the earth. Dear God, thank you for all that is good, for our creation and for our humanity, for the stewardship you have given us of this planet earth for the gifts of life and of one another, for your love, which is unbounded and eternal. O thou most holy and beloved, my companion, my guide upon the way, my bright evening star, we repent of the wrongs we have done. We have wounded your love. O God, heal us. We stumble in the darkness light of the world transfigure us we forget that we are your home spirit of god dwell in us eternal spirit living god in whom we live and move and have our being all that we are have been and shall be is known to you to the very secrets of our hearts and all that rises to trouble us living flame burn into us Cleansing wind blow through us, fountain of water well up within us, that we may love and praise in deed and truth. Eternal Spirit, flow through our being and open our lips, that our mouths may proclaim your praise. Let us worship the God of love. Alleluia, Alleluia. Let us say responsibly by whole verse, Psalm 121. I will lift up my eyes to the mountains, but where shall I find help? From you alone, O God, does my help come, creator of the ever-changing hills. You will not let me stumble on the rough pathways. You care for me and watch over me without ceasing. I am sure that the guardian of my people neither slumbers nor sleeps. The God of all nations keeps watch like a shadow spread over me. So the sun will not strike me by day, nor the moon by night. You will defend me in the presence of evil. You will guard my life. You will defend my going out and my coming in this night and always. God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of sound mind. Thanks be to God. Into your hands, O God, I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O God of truth and love. Keep us, O Lord, as the apple of your eye. Hide us under the shadow of your wings. Preserve us, O God, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Praise be to God, I have lived to see this day. God's promise is fulfilled and my duty done. 
At last you have given me peace, for I have seen with my own eyes the salvation you have prepared for all nations, a light to the world in its darkness, and the glory of your people Israel. Glory be to God, sustaining, redeeming, sanctifying, as in the beginning, so now, and forever. Amen. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen. O living God, in Jesus Christ, you were laid in the tomb at this evening hour, and so sanctified the grave to be a bed of hope to your people. Give us courage and faith to die daily to our sin and pride, that even as this flesh and blood decays, our lives may still grow in you, that at our last day, our dying may be done so well that we live in you forever. Amen. O oh God of love and mercy, grant us with all your people rest and peace. The divine spirit dwells in us. Thanks be to God. I'd like to thank you for joining me for Compline this evening. I invite you to return both on Facebook and YouTube this coming Wednesday for a service of morning prayer and to join us next Sunday in person or online for our regular Sunday worship uh, services at 8 a.m. and 10 a.m. And the 10 a.m. service is the one that will be live streamed. And of course, please return next Sunday evening for another service of Compline. For myself and everyone at St. Margaret's, I want to thank you again for being here. Wish you a pleasant evening. Good night.